Hi everybody, I'm Jared. I'm an engineer here at Cedar Hill Fire Protection District. I'm going to take you over a tour of our 7738. It's our brush truck we keep here at Three House. Let's take a look inside. All right, in here we have our iPad. It has our MDT on it. It gives us call information. If we have an EMS call, it tells us where the patient's located. If we have a fire, it tells us what type of fire, whether it be a brush or car fire or a structure fire. And it also gives us directions to the call. Here, we have our siren controls, and we have our light controls up here. Right here is our radio. We can tuck the dispatch, and they can give us other information for our call as well. Let's go take a look at the back of the truck. All right, in this compartment here, we have some tools, some wheel chocks, we have some spare hose, and some uh, chainsaw oil too for when we need to cut down trees or anything for br fighting brush fires. Right here's our pump panel. This operates the pump that gets the water from the tank into the hoses to put the fires out. And back here, we have our leaf blowers we also use for brush fires, chainsaw, and some extra fuels. Back to the back here, here shows our water level in our tank. Our tank holds 300 gallons of water. Let's go ahead and over to this side. If you look down here in this little compartment, we have our rakes and shovels and long handle tools, which we also use for fighting brush fires. Up on top, we have our Halligan bar and our flathead axe back there. We also we can use those to force entries into buildings that might be locked that are on fire. In this compartment here, we have our life jackets for water rescues, EMS bags that has basic EMS supplies, our AED for cardiac arrest. And then in here we have our PPE for, we have spare PPE. In this compartment here is where we keep our SCBAs. So if we come, if we're out and about driving around talking to people and on other calls and there's a fire that comes out, we still have the capabilities to fight a structure fire because we have our SCBAs, we keep our PPE in the back of the truck and we have 300 gallons of water to fight the fire. Alright, so that's it for this truck. Stay tuned for our next video.